Hey, we're back. We're going to be joined by who, a man who could very well be the next senator uh, from Missouri. It would be an upset, in it, but it is a red state. Josh, uh, Josh Howie, and uh, Josh is the current attorney general in Missouri. Uh, Josh, welcome back. Thanks so much for having me, Brian. Hey, no problem. Uh, first off, your reaction to the news that the summit's going to be in Singapore and it's going to be on June 12th. Yeah, great news. I mean, I think that this is uh, President Trump here with the return of uh, the hostages. Uh, this just shows that uh, the president's uh, his work, his leadership on this is working. Secretary of State Pompeo was a great choice. Uh, that choice is already having dramatic effect. And uh, look, I look forward to seeing the outcome of these negotiations. But this is, the left has been very critical of President Trump, of course, across the board, mindlessly, but also on North Korea. And it turns out that they were wrong, that the right. discussions are working, that the president's agenda is working. And I look forward to seeing what comes next. You know, people, uh, you know, even though the, the history is against the sitting president uh, in their his first term, in the first midterm, people are saying the Senate could pick up seats. And there's other people say this could be a blue wave and wipe them out. If they're going to pick up seats, they look at your seat with uh, Claire McCaskill, knowing that she's feeling pressure from you in almost all the polls, it's down, it's well within the margin of error. The last poll was uh, the real clear average has her up by less than two points. So having said that, do you think she'll feel the pressure and vote for Claire, uh, for Gina Haspel? Well, you know, she should vote for Gina Haspel on the merits. Of course, we know that Senator McCaskill makes all of her decisions based on uh, partisanship. She votes with Chuck Schumer almost 90 percent of the times in the time. In fact, you know, Brian, we totaled up the other day how many times Senator McCaskill has voted with Chuck Schumer. It's over 2,700 times. And that's why she's the most unpopular senator in America on a ballot this fall. Only 29 percent of Missourians say that she deserves to be reelected. I mean, this is someone who is doing a terrible job for the people of Missouri, and the people of Missouri know it, and they want to change. So I hope that she will support Gina Haspel. She absolutely should. Uh, Gina Haspel is immensely qualified to be the CIA director, and Senator McCaskill ought to set aside partisanship for once right. and do the right thing. 